Jesus Christ is still your only hope, America. You can't take any of it with you. Hallelujah. Repent. America, Jesus Christ is your last hope. Technology's not going to save you. Bill Gates isn't going to save you. Neither is Windows 2000. Wall Street's not going to save you. God is your only hope. Jesus Christ is your last and only hope. Wake up, America. Do you know why he canceled? No. Then is he going to mind that we're doing this? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, jeez. Uh, <laughs> yeah. mm. I'm very well. Do you, you remember Chrissy? Hi, darling. Nice to How see are you? you? How are you doing? Good. So you're going to play with us tonight? We're going to do a little, like, a uh, little, little pretend skit, kind of. Oh, thank you. Yeah, that was fine, that was fine. We're just standing in the shadow, that's all. Okay, yeah. go ahead. Yeah. Oh, my guy, how was his name? Blue Diamond Phillips. Blue Diamond Phillips, that's right. I, I, uh, no, that's not funny. I have, actually, I thought of this, because it's like her and Anna Hayes are very similar to me. They're like going, you know, you know damn well that when they leave them, right. they're going for cock. Right, so they're, they're really not full-blooded lesbians. I don't think so, no. That there's, they can very easily... I think so. Turn into turn the day that the day the strap on breaks, the day they're up the door. That's funny. Oh shit! Oh motherfucker! What happened? And the whole tray went on the fucking floor. You know what? Oh, I have an inc unholy. Here, let me just tell you, you're in a hotel. Right? Oh, I have an unholy mess. I just fucking listen to this. Oh, listen. You're in a hotel. You call up, right? You come up, they clean it for you, and they bring you a whole new meal. No, I've ruined the couch and, the, and everything. Are you in a hotel? Yeah. They don't care. Oh. Nobody cares. They're insured. They don't give a shit. They probably clean it. Every time that's happened in the past month. couple of nervous breakdowns after this, but uh, not a lot of How long does it take for him to finally bail on the show? Uh, probably right after he got off the phone. <laughs> I, <would laughs> oh, yeah. I don't know, but I'm guessing. Mm -hmm. Right after he Why called... Did he? Uh, what? Why did he quit? Um, I, I don't know. I'm not sure. I think probably because uh, he was stressing out over everything. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is a horribly you know, uncomfortable chair. The hell? This is my sanctum! Get him! Sick of it! Sick Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! This is this is how he gets people. Wow. Yeah. yeah, the person has to lay down. Yeah, you lie. You have to completely lie down. Yeah. And you have to make a high pitched noise, and then he'll get you. Now you're in for it. Good boy. He hates Canadians. Get him. Come on. This will stay in. Yeah. Let me try. Sure. Well, Mr. O'Brien. All right, kids, my time precious. Um, I have to go down the hall and watch old Arsenio shows on tape. Where are the ladies? So the idea, Dave. Uh, yeah, we just, it was mostly just that, uh, that we came down to cheer Scott on. Right. And we just walk in, and then uh, we go into Scott's dressing room, which, of course, is now occupied by Peter. And, uh, and just that Peter potentially pretends to be Scott. Um... The only thing is, Peter Wilson might not want us to get say, so she, yeah. he couldn't be here, so we got Peter Wilson, so we have to finesse that a little bit, yeah. too. Uh, good you know what I'm saying? Because right, guests don't question. like it when you go. Right. Yeah. Sorry, folks. Even right. yeah. When Peter Wilson sees not, this tape, really. she'll be pissed. <laughs> yeah. She's pretty good humor. It's true. But you're right, it only really works so they know that she's a replacement, and if she's, that's kind of insulting yeah. to that was the, That was the, the well, no, I mean, I, I mean, I, you know. I see your point. We go out. Is there a delicate way to, I hope this isn't, but I go out with Peter Wilson. You do? Yeah. I didn't know that. Well, I'm, 
sexually amazing. Is this what? I didn't know that. I didn't want to talk about it. <laughs> Would this not be used? This will never be used. Oh, no, it will I be am back. probably the best lay <laughs> in celebrity town. Oh, I'm like, if that ever got out, gonna, we're not. I would. we never use die. It. But <laughs> can you uncross your legs? Ah, no problem. <laughs> but we never use it. Like, basically, Brian, if it ever got you know around. Yeah. Can you like sort of move your like, move around? Just, yeah. If that got out, how much I could please a woman? Yeah. Uh -huh. How exciting I was yes. in the old sack. That's what I call it. Yeah. Yeah. Sack. Can we just get a few of these? these What's that? Up and down. Oh, that, yeah, that sure. would be nice. Who's not? You're not filming. No, no, of course not. So, <laughs> basically, if I got around, I'd be through. Because my whole persona is yeah, uptight. Is, up yeah, right. a non-sexual. Non-sexual guy. Desperately in need of... What do you mean non-sexual? Huh? That's not my... No, I was saying I'm uptight, but I'm sexual. Why did you were stopping this, there? What? <laughs> Why did you say non-sexual? Well, the, the character, the persona. I didn't think that's what I was putting out at all. What did I say? You said non-sexual. No, I don't think I said that. Okay, now that we're filming this, but cut it. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to think of some bit, like bit right. that we do at the top of the show. Could we be trying to do a Bob Hope uh, cameo walk-in surprise? Thanks for the memories. But we can't get past security down the lobby. Oh, yeah, oh that's, that's funny. funny. That's funny. In between you complimenting us, every now and then you cut to us yeah, trying to get in. We're just going to drop. We're just going to drop, and it's a surprise. Actually, he's talking about us right now, so yeah. it'd be after. But that'd be funny if we were just talking about how I was saying it's like the show's really good, and Andy was like, "Yeah, I'm going to go see it, uh, whatever this weekend or something," and then we're just chatting, and then we cut outside the studio, and you guys are like. Yeah, you no, know, no, we're supposed to go in and sort of do a celebrity cameo. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, you know, the security guard is like, I'm sorry, I do not have you on any. And you're like, it's just. Uh, that's, that's funny. And then, yeah. Or, yeah. Or, just, or I was just are thinking we tackle that, that push my own, we, we just storm in. Yeah. Until you guys really, they push, push, push and try and get in. And then it just gets to where the uh, security guard handcuffs them and then molests them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, I was thinking, right, let's we do, do it. We have footage of them being molested. the memory, and the security guard just comes in, tackles us, and says, yeah. handcuffs us, and takes it out. Yeah. Somebody right walks funny. in with a baby, and you grab the baby and throw it to the security guard and run on. <laughs> <laughs> he throws the baby down, and chases you, and takes your feet <laughs> off. Okay. Conan, thanks for plugging yeah. our show, and we. Oh, and that's so great! You guys could stop by, and then you just cut backstage to the security guard. He's got the baby. He's like. It's always a lot of fun when they stop by. Yeah. I don't think they'll be coming by anymore. <laughs>